So the finding that Vissian warty pigs use tools is significant because for a long time it was thought that only humans use tools, and now of course we realize that many other species do as well. And that tells us that tool use is something that's widespread across the animal kingdom, and that it uses a set of characteristics of capacities that many different species may come to have for different reasons. So it can be interesting to try to understand what are the um, evolutionary environmental reasons that, that lead to being able to use tools. Pigs have many of the same characteristics that other species that use tools also have. They're social. They're known to be generally quite intelligent animals. Um, they're very playful. They like to manipulate objects. So these are all good background conditions that would be associated with tool use. They're also omnivores, and omnivores have to learn how to manipulate and find many different kinds of food over the course of the year across the season. We know very little about Vissian wordy pigs. They're endangered, and that is because their habitat in the Philippines um, is being lost. So we don't know very much about their natural behavior in the wild. It's not very surprising that we observe pigs being able to use tools. What's surprising maybe is that we haven't observed any kind of pig using tools before. The first observation of tool use in the pigs occurred when I was just visiting the zoo, the Ménagerie, in Paris, and I was watching the Vissian Wordy pigs, and I observed the, the one of the females, who was the mother, um, pick up a piece of bark in her mouth and make several digging motions with it, like in the, the rowing motion. And then I looked up literature on tool use in pigs and I found there wasn't anything. There were no scientific reports of tool use in any kind of pig, so then I realized what I had seen was unique and special. In this particular case, it wasn't really clear that the tool use in increases the efficacy of the behavior, so digging with this snout is how pigs usually dig and this is very effective. So we eventually learned that it occurred only in the context of building the nest for the piglet.